This film is intended for eye surgeons for training and education purposes. Hello friends, today our case is 4 years old boy presented with a congenital cataract. Let's begin the case. After creating the main incision and filling the AC with OVD and as soon as I touch the interior capsule, the bomb is explodes. Now what to do? Let's begin. OVD injection to keep the AC well formed, but we have to remember that always when there is a radial turnout capsular extension, we have to inject OVD peripheral to the capsular tear to ensure not to increase the intracapsular pressure. Now with low flow rate, I started to aspirate the exploded lens matter. Actually, there is a few critical factors intraoperatively while operating for a congenital cataract, the anterior and posterior capsulotomy, and then placing the lens in the back. Now the intracapsular pressure is stable. Again, after OVD injection, reform the anterior capsulotomy. And the plan is to set up the cortex and epinucleus from the periphery to the center. Now OVD injection to reform the other side of anterior capsulotomy. Now moving to the most critical aspect in the surgery is how to performing the posterior capsulotomy. I usually underfold the bag with the VT. It's give me a good view and easily to reach the posterior capsule. After the posterior capsulotomy was well performed, now again OVD injection and you can see now the well round regular edges posterior capsulotomy. And now after following the bag with OVD we can inject the foldable IOL in the bag.
the OVD both in front and behind the lens is then removed.